Guys, I'm so excited today to bring to you Hampstead's most expensive listing currently on the market today. It's 6,500 square feet, an acre of land. It's awesome. We are right next to the Intracoastal boat dock. Super excited. And we have to give thanks to Casey McKinney with the Rising Tide team at Intracoastal for allowing us to do that. He's got this listed. But if you guys have any other questions while we're going through this video, feel free to reach out at any time. My number right there, you can text me. That's the simplest way to go ahead and get a hold of me. In the meanwhile, we're gonna have Casey's number and contact information below. We'll have my information below and all that. Let's go ahead and check this place out. It's got so much to offer. Guys, welcome to 360 Old Point Loop. There's a lot of square footage inside to cover, so without further ado, let's go inside and see what this amazing home has to offer. I love these double solid wooden doors. I'm so, so excited to show you this. So uh, upon entering, you've got, I don't know, 20 foot ceilings plus, obviously you got heavy molding, wood flooring. It's, it's, it's expansive and it just it's just starting. All right, so this house has five bedrooms, four full baths, three half baths. It's got an elevator. Obviously, this is it. I mean, look at this shot. Overlooking the pool, which overlooks the Intracoastal, and then further out there, I don't know if you can see it in the camera, is Topsail Island, and then right beyond that is the ocean. Amazing location. Take a look at this. So, so you have two wood-burning fireplaces here, which is a really nice feature. Look at the enormity of this kitchen. If you can't cook for a family of a hundred in here, you're doing something wrong. Massive slabs of granite, they're all brand new. We got built-in appliances. It's just, there's a lot. There's also speakers throughout the entire downstairs, so for entertainment purposes and all that. Can you picture yourself entertaining in this house? I think so. Dining area, watch your head. So as we come around, this makes a big loop and we have a staircase going up from here and from the front door and we have a staircase going up from the kitchen. Another bedroom and it's got its own bath. Look at the size of the base molding and the crown molding. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you the upstairs. One of two staircases. Steel railing, balusters, really nice, nice construction. Everything, it's so grand. So at the top of the stairs here, you have the primary suite which sleeping area, and then you have another sitting, uh, working area to the side, we'll see in a second. But look at this, look at this bathroom. So, dueling closets, and you come in, and this is just palatial. Look at the space in here. All right, it's palatial, there's no other way to put it. Follow me. So back into the primary bedroom. Imagine waking up every morning and having that be your view. And then you come in to, maybe this is your office. Maybe it's your sitting area. Maybe it's your thinking room, which opens to the deck, which overlooks the pool, which overlooks the intracoastal, the boat dock. This, this I find interesting. So another bedroom and I, I don't know, but I think that that would be an awesome little kitty door for maybe you've got grandkids. Heck, maybe for you adults that like to have fun and do silly things. Your little secret doorway to the next bedroom. So all three of these bedrooms here open up to the deck that overlooks the intracoastal and the pool. And of course you have the little, little sneak door. I, I, well, what would that be for? I really, I'm really not sure. Hey, it's an interesting feature. This has its own bathroom, which let's walk around the entire bathroom. Just goes around and around in a circle. Now 
and right here opens to the elevator. But we go left, this is another washroom, laundry room. Okay. Check this out. Down these stairs to the theater. Ah, can you tell the difference in the sound quality already? Everything is hushed, soundproofed. It's got a monster projector here and a big screen that pulls down for your viewing pleasure. This would be the place to watch like Star Wars or the Avengers or something. Look at the size of these speakers. Continuing our journey around to the left here, we have another guest suite with its own bathroom overlooking the detached two car garage, which this house also has an attached two car garage for all of your toys and your storage, which personally I would love for all my four dirt bikes, four wheeler, all my toys. I would love to have room like this to put them. Follow me, we're going up to the third floor. Being in the business 20 years of doing custom metal work, I have to say I do appreciate the steel railings, which is something you don't see very often here on the coast for obvious reasons, but it's, it's really kind of neat to see. It brings a different element, a different cachet to, to the property itself. I don't know what you would call this room other than the great expansive additional bonus room with speakers built in and overview of the intracoastal, these live oaks out here. Of course, a great shot from above of the pool. All right, so we've seen the main floor, the second floor, the third floor. We're gonna go down, we're gonna see the gaming area, which this is definitely the party room. And it looks like the party just recently ended. There's still some leaves in here and all that, but you got your arcade, your seating area, and of course your dungeon. I, I, let's take a look at this dungeon. Help! All right, so all kidding aside, it's just your wine cellar, which is nice, nicely appointed. Plenty of room, coolers, storage. Nice little spot, of course. You gotta have a wine cellar for the game room, right? All right, so we're back outside. We're gonna finish up the tour out here with the pool, with the hot tub, with the pool house. We're gonna check out the dock. So, okay, all of this, all of these amenities, four car garage, essentially over an acre, 6,500 square feet, pool, hot tub, dock with a 15,000 pound boat lift, jet ski lifts, so much to offer. What does what something like this run for? Well, this is listed for $3.9 million currently, which may sound like a lot of money, but in reality, look at this, this is cool. You're going grill in here. In reality, if you look back in 10 years, and it's gonna be interesting to look at this video in 10 years and say, wow, I could have bought that for $3.9 million right on the Intracoastal in Hampstead. What was I thinking? I should have bought it because who knows what it's gonna be worth in 10 years, but this will be a time stamper to see what, it, what it's appreciated for. Let's go check out the dock, the Intracoastal, and what else we have going on here. I also wanna mention, being this close to the water, Right? A lot of people are concerned about flooding and all that. This is not in a flood zone. As you can tell, it is elevated way above the flood level. So there's no issues of flooding here. So here's the performance deck. It's a little wet, a little soggy here. The tide is high. It's got a little fire pit here. I mean, the Intracoastal is basically coming up to this. I don't want to walk through the mud. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to check out the dock. But look at this, you come out here, you can fish off of your own dock, 15,000 pound boat lift, keep your boat out of the water. You've got a floating dock over there and you've got jet ski docks too. It's got everything that you would need or want to play. You wanna go crabbing? Okay, here you go. Throw it in the water and you're crabbing. Look at this, look at this view. Look at this view. You know, they're just, they're not building anymore right on the Intracoastal like this. It's amazing. All 
All right, so this is the detached two-car garage, which mirrors the two-car attached garage. We're gonna check this one out and see what's inside. This is huge. And you've got a whole loft area up above for storage. Yeah, def there's definitely a lot of room for toys here. This is, this is a house built for entertainment. All right, guys, so we've given you a tour of this monster 6,500 square foot home on over an acre with the Intracoastal right there, boat dock, extra garage space, tons of living space. There's so much here. Again, $3.9 million it's currently listed for. Information is below. Thank you for watching. As always, I appreciate each and every one of you. Until next time, peace.